Hi everybody and welcome to new tutorial in Fusion 360. I'm sorry to keep you waiting all this time. I am so busy these days and I decide to make the same tutorials as you can say in my channel, the V12 engine in SOLIDWORKS and Autodesk Inventor. Here I decide to make the same thing in Fusion 360. That's a good um, experience. Uh, as you can see here, we have the V12 engine, pistons, connecting grouts, and a crank shaft. Okay. Uh, to animate this, I will show this joints. I just animate the model. Okay. Um, we can't do all things in this first episode, but I will show you the final result. Okay, I have pictures here. That's the engine, the V12 engine 6.6 .6 liters. And um, okay. Uh, As you can see here, that's the picture of my V12 engine. I decide to share it with you. Then guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you have any question to this of this tutorial, don't hesitate to post a comment and make a thumbs up. Okay. In this episode, we will make, we'll make this. Okay. Using all these features. Okay, I will close this, don't save, close this, don't save, close this again. Let's start with, um, I will show this. Um, okay, offline, okay, it's, I think it's alright. I will choose this one, X, Y, plan, okay. Go to sketch, start with rectangle. Rectangle with that's the radius. Okay, we will make a revolve feature. Okay, revolve. We have diameter of 84 and the radius is 42. Okay, and to switch the distance, just use tab in your keyboard and put 5 here. I will add a circle here with a diameter of 18 and at the distance between these we have 16 and I will add a rectangle here with 3 millimeter here and 0 0.8 here and the distance between between this one this one and this point we have 40 okay i will repeat this using a rectangular pattern and choose this direction here you can switch to spacing and put minus three here okay when you have three flam uh, just use revolve feature and let's say what we can do with this okay I will choose this one okay that's the first thing to do okay when you finish this go ahead and add next step next step is go to rectangle select this plan and add the rectangle with the distance like here we have 25 press d to have the distance and add 20 here now you can add the line to make mirror line here switch to construction and um, Select two of them, go to sketch, go to rectangle, 
and it's not rectangle. Select all of them, go to sketch, mirror. For the mirror line, select this one. Press OK. When you finish this, when you finish this, go to um, go to push pull and select these. Don't forget to in the direction make symmetric. Press OK. The next is to add um, a shell here using five millimeter. Press OK. Then choose this one, go to sketch, press C to have a circle and add a circle with a diameter of 18 and offset with O in your keyboard with 5mm. Once you finish this, add a line starting from here to here and sketch this one. Make this one horizontal and add some dimensions. Press D, add dimension here we have 2 mm and from here we have 40. Here we have 32 and add some relation between this point and this one. Let's move the sketch and see what's going on. I have to fix this in the vertical of this axis. To do this, go to go, go to horizontal vertical constraint and press and choose this point and this one. Don't care of this, just select this one and convert it to construction line and select all of this of this segments. Okay, I think all thing is, is selected. Go to mirror, select this like mirror, press OK. You have just to press and drag this one in this direction. When you finish this, go to push pull and choose this and this one. Press and drag. Make it symmetric, press OK, and you have nice result here. Have to add material here, just select this face, go to sketch, press C to have a circle, look for the center, and you have this zone. Select it, press Q, and put minus 5 here. Make sure it's arrested here and select this one, press C again and you have to add circle here. When, when I select this one, I will add a circle here. Okay. When you have this zone, press Q and add 5 millimeter. Press OK. Now it's time to add fillets, select this one, select this one and put 10. The same thing for this, using control in your, in your keyboard to select all of these. Return your model like this one and select this, press OK. Now it's time to add the same thing in this side using mirror and create go to mirror in the pattern tape select features and select these features okay for the mirror select this one like mirror press ok and you have the same result here I will add the holes here, go to right, 
press uh, in the rectangle choose this plan and here switch to center rectangle add two point rectangle here and add dimensions here we have two millimeters and add um, constraint here choose horizontal select this point and this point and for coincidence select this and this one and you have this result go to push pull select this zone and press and drag click and drag when you see this red is red press ok I will repeat this using pattern here circular pattern and in the same thing pattern tip choose features select this like a feature and for the axis select this one like max when you select this just add the quantity of 20 here price ok and you have this nice result when you finish this we have to add fillet here and here press F to have a fillet choose this one and put 9 millimeter the same thing here don't forget to press control to select other things okay press ok now I will remove material in the interior of this hole to do this just I will show I will choose this plan and go to sketch go to rectangle start our rectangle start your rectangle here and add dimensions we have 1.1 millimeter here and the distance here we have 10.45 and the distance between this edge and this point put 18 and from here maybe many people asking me um, where I find all these dimensions this dimension I am mechanical engineer and I and made and I made this uh, for real okay and you can download this um, engine in uh, in the say in the website in the description okay I will add the line here like this one I will convert it to this and I will select it to make a mirror in this side go to sketch mirror and for the mirror line here select this one press ok when I finish this go to create revolve and go to for the profile select these like profiles for the axis don't select this one but select this one when you finish press ok and you have a nice result here now I will remove materials here to do this select this one this plan and go to sketch press C to have a circle and add the circle here with 0 0.5 is okay and the distance between this point and this one we have 0 0.5 add relation or constraint between these points and repeat this I will select it and go to sketch pattern rectangular pattern here I will select spacing for the quantity I will put one here for the quantity I will put 20 I will see if okay it's okay 
then I will remove material using this feature create revolve I will select all of this for the axis I will select this one and press OK and we have nice result here now I will create I will create a plan using a construction of okay? a okay offset plan for the offset plan I will select the, or the original plan in this one plan not plan mm, I will put here 18 once you finish this select your new plan and go to sketch go to your rectangle and choose this rectangle add this one like a rectangle and add these dimensions we have from here to here we have 19 and the angle between these we have 78 and this one has 13.5 add the relation between this one and this one and all thing is all right just go to a revolve feature again select this one like profile for the axis select this one press ok and you have a nice result here mirror this using create mirror and for the mirror line not mirror line here mirror plan select this one and now we will mirror it in the other side just select two of them using the features here and go to create um, mirror okay please tell me if you if you are hearing me so good because I I buy a uh, new microphone uh, as you can see here I think I have HD um, sound uh, just leave me a comment if you hear me good okay and if you have any suggestion or or question don't hesitate to post it just here we'll add my logo or my name here select this um, surface okay and go to text press here to add your text here for me I will write camera 9 press OK and I will use all these things to make a rotation like this one okay use push pull and put minus 0 0.1 press ok and we have nice result here just to add fill it to have nice view using these I will add 0 0.1 maybe 2 okay then use uh, control to select other things okay that's uh, this step is not uh, it's not this step it's not necessary if you you can you can leave it like this one okay thanks for watching if you like to receive more videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you find this tutorial helpful please make a thumbs up cheers